In this video, I'll show you how to make an awesome head out of this Frontman 15G. Um, as a small amp, it's, it's fairly good. Um, but the main reason uh, it's not very good is because of the speaker. What's inside the amp is actually really good. And I read uh, on the internet how to make this an awesome head to use with my Marshall. Okay, so I'll show you. I want to make it nice, so it, yeah, I just want to make it look good. So what I'm gonna do um, is the back side here. I'll cut it up here and cut it down here, and this will basically be the height. And I'm gonna remove what's left down here because I'm gonna remove the speaker. All you have to do actually is connect the speaker wires to an output jack. The output jack I'm going to place on the back side here, somewhere, uh, and just make the amp smaller so it looks like a head. I think it's going to look like it's, it was supposed to be a head, so, uh, so we'll see. I'll show you when it's finished. Here you can see what I did. This is the speaker wire. I connected that to the output jack. Um, and I cut off the, the cabinet, made it smaller, so it just sits like that. This is what's left of it. Just cut all that out, cut that out of the back, cut that out of the front. The speaker's gone. Yeah, so now it's just a hit. Let's see what it can do. Now it's plugged in. As you can see, dirty volume on two, gain four, normal volume two and a half. That's the settings. Running through a Marshall 4x12. And I'll be playing on my 70s uh, Ibanez Silver Series Strat. I'm just gonna jam something for you, just so you can hear. that it can play. So, no effects other than the Fender Frontman 15G. Sounds pretty good. An awesome head just for practicing at home, I think. And maybe small gigs. I don't know if, if it's loud enough. But right now I got it on two. I can crank it up a bit. something in my ear.